All right, my next guest knows food and he knows about finding good people. Julian Medina is the chef and the owner of seven restaurants, including his newest, Tolache Thompson. Not one to shy away from innovation in food or taste, he is incorporating a Jewish Mexican menu for the Passover holidays. Julian Medina, great to have you with us here on Bloomberg. Thanks for having me. Let's start off talking about the restaurants that you have and how you came to produce this kind of fusion of food and flavors and ingredients. How did this all start? Well, me being from Mexico, um, I, I came here to New York like 18 years ago. And my passion for food is just like what driven me to open all these restaurants. So I have a Toloache, which is Mexican, Yerbabuena, and Copelli as well. So, um, you know, it's just very exciting for me just to open uh, different cuisines. What were some of the challenges to get people to rethink Mexican food? Well, Mexican is just very best, so, um, and people love Mexican food. I mean, these days is the number one growing cuisine all over the state, so it's just very important for me to open you know, Mexican food and Mexican restaurants and people understand all about Mexican. All right, but it's not just Mexican because I'm looking at pictures of uh, matzo balls yeah. and uh, various types of things made from matzo. Maybe you can explain this to people that aren't familiar. Well, I make uh, the Jewish holidays also part of our tradition, being Mexican and uh, Jewish. So we incorporate a couple of uh, both cultures, like now it's uh, coming Passover. So, um, you know, I create this uh, white fish guacamole with matzah, we serve it with matzah, and then um, I make my own uh, tacos, um, hand-pressed tortillas with matzah meal, and I, I make my own matzah bowl soup. So we have a different variation on that, so when people get started, of the same eating the matzah every day, you can come to Toloache and have uh, different food. Is this also part of the tradition inside of Mexico or is this something that you have uniquely created? Well, in Mexico, there is uh, uh, the, the Jewish uh, community is big, but what I create all these dishes here, being in the States and just uh, incorporate, uh, um, you know, uh, these, these cool cultures at the same time. So I, I think it's just great uh, that people can enjoy and come and, you know, have a Seder also as well at the restaurant, so it's, it's kind of fun. I mentioned that it's not just about selecting the food, it's about selecting the people that you work with. I mean, running seven restaurants all at the same time, it's like balancing those plates, you know, the, right. while, while they're spinning. What are some of the requirements that you have for people that want to get interested in this business with you? Well, first, to be excited, not to be excited to work in this business that is either you love it or you hate it. So I, you see right away when you interview someone that, uh, you know, if they have the passion for the restaurant business, that's the, that's the key and essential for, for to run a successful restaurant business. What about trying to get the right kinds of supplies? Because not all matzah is created yeah. equal and not all <laughs> fish is created equal. How do you source these different things? Um, well, now with, uh, you know, with expansion of the restaurants, we've been uh, trying to go to the markets and pick up our own ingredients. So that makes it some, something that is consistent every time. All right. Now, a lot of people want to know not only what to do if they want to make guacamole, but how do they make it consistently great? Well, uh, it's how to pick the uh, ripe avocado. That's that's what makes the guacamole, basically. Whatever you want to put inside, inside or around it, is, it doesn't really matter. It just has to be seasoned it right, but how to pick a uh, an avocado that is ripe. So that's the key. That's the I think we're going to have to go picking with you. Thank yeah, you very anytime. much. Thank you for having me. Julian, Julian Medina, he is the chef and the owner of Toloache Thompson and six other restaurants. Still ahead.